Two weeks ago, Feld Entertainment made some extraordinary news. In the history of 145 years of Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey, the Feld family decided to transition all of the elephants with the greatest show on earth off the traveling circus units and bring them to the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Center of Elephant Conservation in Central Florida. So the 13 elephants who are currently on tour with Ringling Brothers will join these two magnificent ladies at the Ringling Brothers Center in Polk County. The reason for this decision, as we said when we announced it, when the Feld family looked across the legislative landscape, it really was becoming a challenge to run Ringling Brothers as a business because different cities had adopted different unnecessary circus regulations. So really, rather than fight City Hall all across the country, the decision was made that we would use those resources to really work on saving an endangered species. A lot of these organizations that make claims about our mistreatment are doing it to advance their own philosophy and in a lot of cases, raise money. Really a lot of this is all about them raising money by making statements about Ringling Brothers. We're in the business of actually caring for these animals where a lot of these groups that make those claims don't care for animals at all. Clearly everything you see in the show is based on natural behaviors. The elef elephants do stand on their heads. I've actually seen them stand on their heads unprompted. We have an elephant at the Ringling Brothers Center that balances on four large balls. No one taught him how to do that. He just figured it out. Um, our staff are there when they're born. So they're around people. They're very comfortable with people. So they spend a, you know, all their time. Really, you know, when you see them in the show and they go tail to trunk, baby elephants walk around with their trunk wrapped around your arm. They get a little larger. They wrap a little tighter. But uh, again, it's, it's, it's an amazing thing to see. Our trainers do use a tool, it's a proved elephant husband tool called a bullhook or a guide. It's approved by USDA, the U.S. Department of Agriculture, as well as the American Veterinary Medical Association. It is the best humane and appropriate tool for working with large elephants. We will still have tigers, we'll still have camels, horses, dogs, a variety of other animals. Just by the beginning of 2018, all of the elephants will be at the Ringling Brothers Center. They just had an issue with elephants. So as a result of this change, Right now, all these municipalities where we had a problem playing will still be able to bring Ringling Brothers to those cities.